I almost killed my phone. No, it's okay. It's all right. Hi, everyone. Welcome back. Today, I have a tag video that I'm doing thanks to Courtney K. She created the Would You Rather tag Project Pan Edition. Yeah, Project Pan Edition. So I am going to go through some questions that she came up with and just answer them and see if I would rather this or that. So let's see, first question that I have, would you rather do a year long or a or three to four month projects, which I guess are seasonal projects? Well, right now I am doing both. I am doing a year long project and I'm doing seasonal projects which are one to two to three months, it depends. But which one would I rather rather do? I think I would rather have just a bunch of little projects because that way I get to kind of rotate the stuff that I'm going through and not just uh, focus on, oh my God, I have these items that I need to finish up during the year and I'm trying to focus on all of them. I'd rather just rotate my projects and get through my products that way. Would you rather pan an eyeshadow palette or a face palette and you can only use it till it's used up or till it's finished? Oh my god. This one I'm also doing. I'm doing a pan that palette with a BH Cosmetics Forever Nude and let me tell you that thing has everything in there. It has six shadows, it has two blushes, two lipsticks and a huge highlight in there. So I'm kind of doing that, both of those in that challenge. But if I would rather do one or the other, I think I would rather do the eye palette because it's easier to use up a shadow palette than it is a blush. Blushes take forever and even though you can multitask blushes as well or a face palette, I think I would rather go with an eyeshadow palette. Would you rather pan a red eyeshadow or a lipstick or a red lipstick and you have to use these till they're done? This is a kind of hard one. Uh, dang, a red shadow or a red lipstick. My logic is saying just pan the red lipstick, but we all know that red lipsticks take forever to pan. And then there's a shadow and you can just multitask it in all kinds of ways. Um, uh, I don't know. I'm working this out in my head like if it was this huge math problem. I'm kind of thinking, okay, red shadow, I can mix it with uh, other colors and make like oranges and make purples and all this, but that is just, oh, it's too much. I think I would, I think I would go with a red lipstick. I'll just go with a red lipstick and just use it till it's gone. Those take forever, but I'm just gonna bite the bullet and say I would rather pan a red lipstick. Would you rather wear lipstick or blush for six months until you use it up? Or just for six months straight, either or. I think I would rather wear, I think I would rather wear the same lipstick for six months because I can just pick like a nude lipstick and just wear it throughout the six months. I won't really get tired of it because I'm not one to be changing out my lipsticks all the time. I can go using the same one and that's it. And that's kind of a little harder to do with a blush because I'll get bored. I'm kind of bored with my Project Pan blush, but I have to. So I think for this one, I will pick definitely a lipstick. Would you rather do a 100 pan or 50 pan roulette that lasts throughout the year. So would I rather do a 100 project pan or a project 50 uh, pan roulette? Hmm. I think I was going to pick the 100 pan because that way I can just pick 100 items and just use them throughout the year. But I think I would rather do a 50 pan roulette because that way I get to pick different items that I have no control over and I get to use them all throughout the year and it's less pressure using 50 items as opposed to 100. It's like you're stuck with 100 items throughout the whole year. Yeah, I'll pick the 50 Project Pan Roulette. Would you rather use up a favorite product to get use out of it or use up your least favorite product to get rid of it? Oh my God, okay. Logic states 
that I would rather use my favorite product and get use out of it, but I want to get my money's worth and if the item that I don't like is not that bad, then I'll go ahead. I would rather use it up that way. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to throw it away and okay, there goes the money that I spent on it. I'd rather use it up and let it go and never buy it again. Would you rather pan all your makeup till it's gone or declutter all of it and start fresh? Oh my god. Okay, there's a lot of people that would just rather declutter everything and just start fresh because hello, it's an opportunity to just go and buy more makeup. I think I would rather just pan, pan because it's, I know this can sound kind of weird and lame and it's like, okay, you need to get a life. But I get more excitement over panning an item and knowing that I used it up. I got use out of it. I got my money's worth and I did it. It's like an accomplishment. It is harder to use up a product than just to go and buy one. So rather than buy everything new, I'd rather use what I already have and just feel super accomplished because I'm doing a great job. <laughs> Would you rather lose your favorite product or repurchase a product that you hate? This one's really easy. I would rather lose my favorite product, which I have done, and go repurchase it because why buy a product that I hate? It, that makes no sense to me. Why buy a product that I hate just to have it there and having to pan it and not use my favorite item? Yeah, not gonna happen. I would rather lose my favorite item and go repurchase it. End of story. Would you rather pan glitter eyeshadow or a black lipstick? You must wear it every day until it's gone. Where did you get these questions from, Courtney? Seriously. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess I would rather wear a glitter shadow because I'm not afraid to go out during the daytime with a smoky eye and just crazy night makeup. I don't care. I can do that. I can wear glitter every day. I can wear it for work I can do I can do all that but black lipstick that's gonna take me a while I I am not one to wear black lipstick especially for work or no I would rather wear a glitter shadow until it's gone last question is would you rather tag a specific friend or everyone to do this tag this one I know Courtney chose both and I'm going to have to do the same. I have specific people that I want to tag and I also, if you want to do this tag, I also challenge you to do it and join in and let us know which you would rather do and that will make it just interesting rather than, you know, it's like, oh my God, I singled people out and now nobody else can participate. Well, no, I'd rather just have anybody that wants to do it, just go ahead and do it. Let us know what you're picking and with that being said, here are the people that I'm going to tag and I'm going to have them linked down below in the description bar so you can go check out their channels and check out their videos because they're awesome. And if I didn't list everyone, I have so many people that I think are awesome but I cannot list everyone so I just quickly jotted down people that came to mind and those are the people that I'm going to specifically tag. But you know who you are, you know I think you're awesome so you are officially tagged. Let me get started. First on my list is Lisa the Glam. Next, it's Celeste from Celestial Beauty. Nikki Murphy, of course, can't get away. Lydia, that lady, you are tagged. Tambri, bless your heart. Child, you're doing this one with us. Sabrina Faith, you know, tag, you are it. Next is Kristen K. Kristen, you are tagged. Bethany, I also tag you, girl. Um, Lynn from Mommy Wears War Paint, not gonna get away. Rita B, cool as can be, she is tagged as well. I also tag Valerie Hill, Betsy from Make Up Your Mind, and of course, Janene. I have to tag you as well, girlfriend, and I have a tag pending with you. Which I'm gonna get to I promise I promise so those are the people that I'm tagging and again you are also tagged and challenged to join in on this one thank you Courtney for coming up with this tag it was super fun doing a 
this or that would you rather kind of challenge especially with a project pan theme behind it I love project panning I'm all about that project pan life thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one bye